Good morning cats and kittens and feral souls and my YouTube darlings. Well, I am not in the tiny element this morning. I'm in a shop. I'm working on a video for you. And I'm getting the, I'm getting some more modifications done to the ninth element. I'm going to take you on a little tour here and introduce you to some really fine people and show you what's going on. Good morning cats and kittens and feral souls and my YouTube darlings. Well, I am at the Linex shop this morning, early on a Monday morning in early October. I've got Mike over here behind this door. He is taping off the Honda Element and getting it ready for some uh, truck bed liner. They do Linex liners for trucks here. They only had black, so they were willing to work with me and use mine which is the Raptor that I got from Amazon, and I'll leave a link in the description below. Um, they are doing this job for me because I have bad carpal tunnel in my hands, and I can't do this motion for too long, so we'll just take a look at the vehicle while it's getting ready, and then I'll come back and show you what it looks like after prep. Just to keep the product you're spraying okay. in the places we don't want it. Right. Rather easy. taping it off and then it's going to be sanded right and then uh, cleaned up and then they have product applied so the guys have got the element set this is the area in here that's going to be painted okay wow these guys <laughs> they have they, they've, they've wrapped ninth completely because they don't know where this stuff is going to land when it's when it sprays so I wouldn't, I wouldn't have done this if I did it myself. I, I would not have wrapped it with plastic. Okay, these guys really messed up my doors. Look at this. Okay, that's the sanding. That's the sanding part of this application. So what happens next, guys? Now we're gonna blow it off and then we'll wipe it. Uh-huh. And then we'll spray it. Then you'll spray it? And then we wipe down with alcohol to get the excess off. See, I would have not have done it this good. All right, guys, this is the final product of the Raptor. Let me just take you around to the other side. And here is the other side. Now, I do recognize it's a shade different, but they did a perfect job. The whole purpose of this is to protect the sides in the bush. So I love how it turned out. I really do. Oh, hello, cats and kittens and feral souls and my YouTube darlings. I'm interrupting this video in progress to talk about today's sponsor. Today's sponsor is Top Dawn, and this is a tiny power bank for jumping the Honda Element, as well as I can jump trucks and other things. So I want to thank Top Dawn today for being the sponsor of today's video, and let's dive into this product. Thanks for being here. Okay, well, today's sponsor is Top Dawn, and we are going to be jumping the ninth element because she's dead. The Top Dawn jumper comes in this handy little case. You open it up. Inside is this USB-C cable and that's what you use to recharge it. 
you turn it on right here. It lets you know that it's fully charged. You plug in to right here. And then you hook these up to the battery. Red for positive, black for negative. Let's see if ninth will start now. Here we go, second time. Let's see. Oh, what a success. Thank you, Top Dom. Good morning, cats and kittens and feral souls and my YouTube darlings. I'm moving at a ninth. Why? Join me today. I will be removing this dresser and these cabinets, that drawer, this new dresser. It'll all make sense real soon. Uh, so far, I have the bed out. I'm working on emptying out the drawers, taking out the fridge. Hi, Fred. Hello. How's it going? We're back at the shop again today. <laughs> so he's taken out uh, the build. Look what I found. What did you find? Oh, oh what is it? I don't know. It's stuck to oh, the back of oh, the like, oh, some, oh, look at, yeah, we're finding all kinds of things. That's my vitamins. Sharp mind mood. Anything else in there? No. Nope. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're finding from me living on the beach, you see that screw, it's hard to show up on the camera, but all my screws have rusted. I don't know if I've talked about this before, and that's from living on the coast. Here it is, almost everything's out. Look at how big it is in here, oh my goodness. Yes, this will be very cozy for my little jaunt to get the lift in the Honda Element. Okay, and there's space right there. All the necessities. Well, hello, cats and kittens. It looks way different in here. Oh my God, there's so much room and it's hollow. Okay, off to our next part of the adventure of what's happening next to the Honda Element. So follow me. I am at the Gresham Honda in Portland, Oregon. And 9th is going to be, let's see here. 9th is uh, getting her lift today and a bunch of other work and stiffer suspension because She's, got, she's sagging, so we're also gonna go live.